Hey friends, it's April Holly Smith and it is time once again to have a look at the ads. Here on my channel, we do some household uh, budgeting stuff. Some of that surrounds groceries and the first step in that is to have a look at the ads and to distinguish what's on sale and what's not even on sale because there's a lot of that not on sale stuff in these ads. So if you wanna go through and find out what those things are, and what a good price and what isn't a good price for the sale things. Let's get started right now. Okay, so we are gonna start with the Save A Lot ad and then we're gonna move to the Aldi's ad. So Save A Lot here on our front page has some really good deal things. So right away we see this, this five pound pack. This is a family pack which is generally a five pound pack. Um, sometimes there's some chicken that's three or three and a half, but it will generally spe specify that. So let's see here, that's um, five, six, seven, seven and a half. We're looking at 750 for this tray. It's gonna come in a big tray um, for boneless, skinless chicken breast. Now I'm a big fan of and this is this works whether you are a Duggar sized family or if you are a single person. Um, buy the quantity and then break it up into meal sized portions. So if you have two people, if you're a couple or you're a college student, whatever, um, you know, a family of four, because I know a family of four with two teenagers and a family of four with toddlers, vastly different <laughs> needs. So uh, most of the time when you get the chicken breasts, a serving size is four ounces, so it's about half. So if you're a single person, you would get these and half these, and then I would put them in like quart freezer bags and just toss them in the freezer so you can grab them. And that way they're already pre-portioned out for a meal. Uh, you can go ahead and slice them whichever way you like. You can cube them even like pre-process it. The great thing about these cubes, if you ever do soup or something like that, it's awesome for that. Cause you, I know for my instant pot and even my crock pot, I just dump that stuff in free, frozen and let it go. And it will eventually get it all cooked, which is pretty awesome. So I'm a big fan of that. So you can do, like I say, all your slices or you can do multiple chicken breasts and however um, style that you like them. I'm a big fan of this. So when you're budgeting for your plan for your shopping list, budget about $7.50 per tray. Now, of course, it's by weight. So sometimes it's higher and sometimes it's lower. We all know that, but you know, that's a thing. This is a great price for a salad mix because right now at my Aldi's, which is the cheaper of these two stores, of these two, um, a head of lettuce is a dollar forty nine. It was a dollar twenty nine for a long time, but this is not what it is anymore. It's a dollar fifty. So this is a real good deal. Um, <laughs> something that I used to do all the time when I worked at Girl Scouts and was camping on the regular. I used to go and buy these, and I would buy salad dressing, and I would literally just cut the, the a top the top off so it was an open bag and I would dump the salad dressing in and just eat it right out of the bag so it didn't dirty a bowl. So if you are a single person <laughs> or packing lunches, that sort of thing, just try it. Just try it one time. See if it if you if it works for you. Some people don't like it, some people do, but I'm just saying it might save you a dish or two. So this $3.99, I feel like this is I say this, this deal comes around a lot. Save a lot really likes their beef to be $3.99, kind of no matter what it is <laughs> when it's on sale. So I'm not going to be jumping up and down to buy a bunch of this, but if I was looking for some beef, this would probably be the thing that I was going to buy. Okay, so down here um, we have... Okay, so number one, I'm going to tell you why this this is not a good deal. You should never, ever, ever, ever for name brand, off brand, whatever, you should never pay more than a dollar. And I'm, and I'm talking like the 99, 95 cents. You should never pay more than that. 
these are a dollar 25 and they were a dollar 78 uh no let's just say no to that and the reason that i'm pretty staunch on this is that these items are shelf stable you don't have to have a freezer you don't have to have a refrigerator they can sit uh on a counter they can sit on uh, a floor they can sit under a cabinet kind of wherever you need them to be and they will hang out they have a hugely long shelf life so if you know that you have things coming up that are um birthdays um celebration nights you're gonna have root beer floats like on whatever traditional day uh wait until they're on sale and then buy as many as you're going to need for two or three months and just sit on them because this costs way too much this is okay this deal comes around all the time so this is ten dollars for two and a half so that's four hold on you know i can't do math in my head so i actually have to pause this and do some math hold on okay so i had to do some math so this is about four dollars a pound and so i don't feel like that's terribly great but it is thick cut bacon and thick cut bacon is obviously just much more in a slice so i don't know that i would get it but this this bacon tastes good i can personally vouch for that okay so special buys almost always are in this this green color so you can kind of be color coded on this look i can get it so we can see everything so this is special to look at when it comes to save a lot for uh two reasons number one actually it's probably all this one big reason um these are not things they typically carry so it, it is a true sale in that the price is um special for this period of time and they don't always carry these items sometimes it is it in fact almost always it is a special thing that they bring in although they do very often have sales on things like Coburn Farms which is their store brand so um that's one reason that you should double check this because it's not stuff they usually carry and it's on sale the other thing is save a lot accepts coupons for their name brand items so you might look and go ah, that's not really that good a deal i can get that at another store blah 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 or it's only like 20 cents less or you know just a little bit but if you have a 50 cents off coupon all of a sudden that becomes that's a different that's a whole that's a horse of a different color so make sure that you double check your things because like these Texas toasts, I feel like this Texas toast has a coupon very often. These always seem to have a coupon. So you're going to want to double check against your stash of coupons to see if these are an even better deal for you. Okay, so as we move on to the center section, healthier choices for the new year. Okay, so remember how I said there are things that are not on sale? Okay, these are not on sale. This entire section okay so this section is special this section is not at all these items are all 100 percent regular priced so do not feel like you have to have a sense of urgency to get these because they're not going to run out they carry this stuff 100 percent of the time and this is the price of it it's not going to go up next week this is just what it is so don't feel a sense of urgency on stocking up and don't feel like you are um, gonna miss out because you're not um these are not really on sale either um they're not food i don't always spend a ton of time commenting on non-food items although i do talk about them sometimes in the aldi so on the back page we do come back to the food um okay so i will say here this was sold in a three pound pack so that's um three, two four six six three six nine so that's 690 for this package of ground turkey um i happen to think turkey is about the best meat known to man even the ground turkey is really good i especially love a ground turkey meatloaf um and i'm talking about like the kind with carbs <laughs> actually even the kind without carbs if you put italian seasoning bind it together with an egg and form it and bake it it just I, honestly i just think it's it's my personal taste it is 
so stinking delicious. Um, these sirloin chops, these are okay. So they're under $2, which is good, but I would really like to see these at like $1.69 um, would be like my sweet spot for these. And again, a family pack means five pounds unless it says otherwise. This is a five pound. Um, now, when it comes to steaks, and these are round steaks, so you're you're going to look at that five pound mark. But in my store, if it's a T-bone steak or any other kind of like steak steak, like a, a New York strip steak type thing, that family pack will mean three steaks. That's always what it means. Um, none of this stuff here is looking great to me. This, I will say, is an outrageous price. Um, $1.29 is what my Aldi's price for pineapple is basically all the time. I want to say they might have slightly gone up to $1.49 in the last like week after um, the holiday. Because, you know, pineapple is a heavy, Christmas is a heavy pineapple holiday because of the hams. Um, but I think that the sale is like over and I think this is where, where my regular, that's a whole dollar more. So don't get them here. <laughs> don't do it. Okay. Um, this is okay. That's it. So that's my, my main thoughts on the save a lot. I, this turkey is making my mouth water but this is your sweet spot right here um and like i say if you get the tray process them down into meal size portions so that you don't have to pull the entire five pound tray you can pull two or three pieces out and make dinner or lunch or whatever it is your configuration is needed in that salad okay so here we go let's have a look at the aldi's um ad so right here we have our top three these blueberries are good to go. This is a great price for uh, the dead of winter. I will tell you that probably every other day, Lillian comes to me and asks me, do we have blueberries? No, no, we don't, Lillian. Because <laughs> they were on sale for $1.29 or 99 cents, like right before the holiday. And I bought a whole bunch and she was just in her glory because she had a whole package to herself. And then she ate her sisters and she tried to horn in on mine. So um, these are a good deal. I would go for this. This is a five pound bag of grapefruits. That's probably like six grapefruits. I don't, I know that five pound bag seems huge, but grapefruits are the big berthas of the, of the family. But especially if they're these pink ones, my favorite. Um... This is a good price for Gala apples too. The this three pounds here, that's less than a dollar per pound. I think it's like seventy five ish cents, um, just under that. I can't do the math in my head, but anyway, uh, <laughs> someone will post below what the math is on that. So we're gonna move on down to this section. I'm actually gonna open this up. Oh, it'll be fine because it's just an you'll see. okay. So. All of these things here are on sale. Um, this is kind of like a regular price. This happens pretty often. Now, the thing is, um, these come pre-packaged in their own tray. So just because they're $1.29 doesn't mean the tray will be exactly that. Because often it's like $0.99 cents a pound and you get like a pound and a half or something for a dollar twenty nine or something. It's like like that. So this is not the world's best deal, but it's fresh vegetables for not a terrible lot of money, especially if you like to have this in your spaghetti squash or your spaghetti sauce, not squash. Um, it's really good just fried as a side dish too. Um, I'm gonna say no to this. Not really this. Not really. Not really. Um, okay, so down here. <laughs> This is the same thing on sale, direct comparison. So Aldi's fresh chicken breast, but these are $1.69 with a limit of four. Now, these were $1.49. So Save-A-Lot is going to have the better price. So if you have a Save-A-Lot and you're going there, get them there. This also has a limit of four. So, uh, but $1.69 is pretty darn good. 
$1.89 is what they are at my store all the time. So never ever pay more than that because that's my regular everyday price. Same, same advice. It's the same stuff as this. Process it down. Um, none of these, I'm not buying fake meat. I'm just not into that. It's not my lifestyle choice. If it's yours, that's cool. It's just not for me. Um, I typically do not buy thin sliced pork chops because they just charge extra for them. Like it's less meat. Why are you charging so much? Um, this three pound ground turkey is $7. Seven divided by three divided by seven. Uh, two, six, ten, three, six, nine, that's three. It's about the same when you do the math. Um, yeah, it's like nine cents. This, so this is a three pound package and this are essentially the same thing. So just be aware of that. Okay, so I'm going to flip this page down and oh my goodness look at this you guys everything on this page is red typically when you get down here you start to see the black prices and when i say that you're like what it's so what what color who cares about the color they're printed in this girl cares and the reason is all of these red prices mean these are actually on sale Woo! pork rinds are on sale my keto friends oh my goodness um, <laughs> the red price means is on sale and when you're looking at the ads for all these, it's a really easy way to, to give a quick comparison for non-seasonal, non-AOS items. So everything here is on sale. Look, steamable medley. I love this. And for 79 cents, I'm good with that for the 12 ounce as opposed to the pound. I prefer the pound. Look, they have low carb tortillas on sale. Well, I might be trying those this week. Wow. These pork rinds are on sale. Wow. These nuts are on sale. Um, this almond flour is on sale. Yes. Keto dream. The keto, the keto ice cream is on sale. Now, there's a couple things here. I can't have these um, protein bars because I can't have whey or casein. I'm actually allergic to the protein in milk, which is the, everything now anytime it's like now with protein that's it's always like whey protein because it's super cheap it's like actually like a byproduct of some food processes but um so i can't eat those which is a real bummer but like i say there's some things on here that i'm gonna check out i can't have this because i know this has this has actual cream in it but um that could be good for you. It is a whole dollar off for that little pint. It's so tasty. Um, okay, we're going to flip over. Okay, so now do you see that we've hit the, the we've hit the wall of black prices? So all of these are regular prices. So just like that center section with Save a Lot, you don't have to have a sense of urgency to get these because they're things they carry all the time. And this is the price that they're at. It's not changing. So I'm not going to spend a ton of time talking about this. These are all things that they think that you want because it's the time of the year. That may or may not be true based on what you are, um, what you're doing. Are you working on like weight loss goals? Like a lot of food related resolutions happen right now. I want to eat clean. I want to eat keto. I want to eat vegetarian. I want to fill in the blank with the food uh, related goals that's why they're showing you these things so then down here this is what we call i call we the the aldi community the aos now aos stands for <laughs> isle of savings isle of seasonal and depending on how you behave the isle of shame uh, <laughs> all three of those are commonly um accepted uh acronyms for aos and again this is for fitness related goals resolutions life plans that are happening right now um down here we have a lot of bathroom stuff and again this kind of comes with new year new you this is something i can spruce up it's it's easy to redo your bathroom things 
without having to redo your bathroom fixtures, which will make it feel fresher. So that's why you see a lot of these. Now you will see that there are like a couple red prices here. This is just a featured item. The aisle, the AOS is the only time the red and black really just don't matter. So, because these prices are what they are for these items and when they're gone, they're gone. They're not gonna get more of them in and the price is not gonna go up next week from this red price. That's, their, their prices are pretty stable um, from what they are here is what they're going to be. So, basically there's there's some food, but not nothing on sale. So, um, your chicken breast is the good deal at Aldi's. Your blueberries, your grapefruit, and your apples. That's the things that are on real good sale. The pork rinds. I'm totally going to try this and I'm going to load up on some of these vegetables as well. So that is the roundup for this week's Aldi's and Save-A-Lot. If you have questions, please comment down below. I will be happy to do my best to give you all the answers that I know. Don't forget to like and subscribe and click on ye old uh, emojis and things like that in the comments because they're fun and they help my channel and it doesn't cost you anything to support me in that way. And I totally appreciate it. Thanks, guys. Bye.